Hey guys, so I'm gonna tell you a story. What is the store that everybody hates to admit that they shop at? It's Walmart. It's Wal everybody hates to admit that they shop at Walmart. Even though the prices are okay, everybody has nothing but bad things to say about Walmart. I was debating on telling you guys that I was at Target, but you know, I wanted to be honest, so I'm gonna be honest. And you know that whenever you go into a Walmart, you always shop too fast because you're afraid that you're gonna find someone that you know at Walmart and you're gonna go through that awkward situation of, hi, yes, I'm here, you're here, let's just get this over with. Nice to see you. Ah. Uh. Oh, the awkward, it feels so good. So I'm waiting in the self-checkout lane because if you're not in the self-checkout lane, then you're in one of the other lanes, which is occupied by 15 other people with carts that are just filled to the brim. You can find the strangest things in these people's carts, okay? You can go to the dump and you won't find things that you can find in one of these people's Walmart carts. It's like you want to go up to these people and help them out, you know, give them an intervention. Do you really need that tiny pillow that's hard as a rock shaped like Patrick from Spongebob. Do you really need that? Do you really need that lamp with the squiggly neck that never works, it just kind of hangs down low? And you know it's doing this, but you buy it anyway because you think it will make your life more convenient when really you're just buying clutter? And four months later, you wonder why you have all this shit piled up in your room that you never use. What? So I'm at Walmart in the self-checkout lane, okay? And I'm almost up to the register when I feel something in my stomach, that churning feeling when you have to fart but you don't want to because you're in a public setting, but you know, it's Walmart, so it, I farted. Yes, I did. There were so many people, okay? There were so many people and I just felt like, you know, whatever. It's Walmart. It smells like fart anyway. This fart did not represent the Terminator. It represented HIV, kinda, silent but deadly. So I'm thinking, hey, I'm in the clear, right? My stomach's clear, I'm feeling good, I'm feeling refreshed. But there was a young woman standing behind me. I don't know how she knew, but she knew that I was the one responsible for the fart. Okay, maybe she smelt it. Maybe she just kind of figured, I don't know. But she knew, somehow. Girls have a way of using words in such a fashion that they kind of turn into those beetles from the mummy. You know, they crawl under your skin and they go up into your brain, you're ah! Oh. And she only needed to use one word. I would have liked it more if she said this. Are you fucking serious? You worthless piece of shit. No, okay, this is what she said. Ugh, really? And I turned to her and I noticed that she's talking to me. So I'm like, uh, excuse me? And she said it again. Really? That kind of leaves things open-ended, you know? She could have meant anything. With the word really, question mark, this means nothing to me, okay? I don't know what you mean. Really what? Really awesome? Really cool? Really fucking nasty? Really smelly? Really fuck you? <sighs> I hate it when women say really in that snarky, sarcastic, bitchy way that fucking, ah, uh, just makes you into a cunt instantly when you say it like that. When girls say, really? To me, I want to fly their ass out to a desert somewhere and bury them up to their necks and cover their head in scorpions and cockroaches and put a sign right in front of their face so they can't miss it and it'll say, yes, comma, Really. Period. Bitch. And to clarify, she says this. Really? You had to fart when you knew that I was directly behind you? You're disgusting. I've come to find that most of my fondest memories began with me thinking to myself, Tyler, what are you doing? Dude, think before you act. Just, just stop, stop, halt, and think before you do anything rash, okay? Just sit and think for a moment before all right, you're, you're just gonna go and do it anyway? All right, just, you know, fuck me, right? I've learned that my conscience is a little bitch and I've learned to ignore it. I had my hands in my pockets and without knowing it, I was rubbing together the lint in my pockets into this weird dead fleshy ball of just thread. I kind of just took my hand out 
I turned to her and I was so annoyed. I was just brought to the peak of annoyance that I don't know why I did it, okay? I, I don't know why. So I flicked this ball of dead skin and lint at her. You know, just, I don't know why I did it, okay? Sometimes I, <laughs> sometimes I just do things. Sometimes things just happen. I don't know why I do them. It just, it landed in her mouth. <laughs> the dead skin lint ball landed <laughs> in her mouth. The look on her face was just sheer terror and disgust and just confusion all around. She didn't know what to think. I realized what I did, you know, pretty quickly. So I didn't pay for my stuff. I just put it down and, and booked it. You know, I was just in exit mode. Get out, 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 out. I don't want this girl hitting me with whatever, you know, object she can reach for. I don't want her punching me in the face. I don't want her screaming bloody murder. But what I do know is that 10 years from now, she will remember this day, okay? She will remember the day that this random guy flicked this ball of nasty lint into her mouth. And I hope, okay, I hope that this memory wakes her up at night. I hope it terrorizes her in her dreams. She would scream in terror until her parents woke her from her nightmare and her mom would say, Oh, was it him again? Was it the guy from Walmart again? And she would turn to her mom and say, Really, mom? Really? Hey God, I got 25 already today. How many do you have? 25? Ha, huh, that's pathetic. I've got 400,056. Actually, God, I think what you really mean is 56 because when people say OMG, it doesn't count. Sure it does. Acronyms, bitch.